Podcast with meteorologist Patrick Evans. You're looking out at the Classic Club, and it's a little bit of a hazy start to the morning. Sun's up, and the temperature's going to start to rise again. Humidity still thick in the atmosphere, not quite as bad as yesterday, but uh, the worst news for us is that an excessive heat warning goes into effect tomorrow morning, but we're going to be up in the one teens today. Yesterday, 110 degrees, but the humidity tamped down our temperatures a little bit. It's a touch drier, but it's going to be a little hotter. Heat advisory in the mountains up to 6,000 feet in the Inland Empire. Moisture still streaming in mid-level and surface moisture. So you're going to notice those dew points are a little higher. Again today, the mechanics of this system, the ridge of high pressure is pulling that moisture over from east, moving it west because we're on the bottom side of this ridge of high pressure. So that increases the moisture, the humidity that we're going to be contending with throughout the day. Holding on to 91 in Palm Springs, just about everybody else mid valleys at 87, a little bit cooler in thermal and also an Indio 85, 82 in thermal. Uh, not uncomfortable this morning, but a little sticky out there. Winds predominantly out of the southeast, particularly as you work your way through La Quinta down toward Mecca, the southeasterly breezes and northwesterly winds coming through the pass, but they die off pretty quickly. Our dew points have improved a little bit. This is the Palm Springs number. We're at 55, so you can use your evaporative cooler, especially newer models might work pretty well. You can see that it's still uh, uh, pretty tough out there dew point wise and moving into this afternoon. I do expect a little bit of drying, not much. By tomorrow, things should be a lot better, but the heat is going to be exceptional again tomorrow. Extreme heat on tap today up to about 114 degrees. If you're thinking about maybe getting a car wash, today's not a bad day to do it. We're certainly not expecting any wind events or precipitation. Uh, so maybe a, a good uh, opportunity to get the car cleaned up for the weekend. Temperatures soaring to 117 tomorrow and similar numbers on Sunday and Monday with that excessive heat warning. We get back to more reasonable temperatures, 109. I know that doesn't sound reasonable, but it's within a degree of our seasonal average. We have more for you coming up right here on News Channel 3, the Desert's News Leader. Stay with us.